Hello everyone, I'm Ken, that's Buff Bro, this is the 1000 Pound Sisters, we're back, everybody loves it, hooray! Except for last time, it was like the least wholesome thing we've ever seen in our whole lives, and all the drama started coming out, and uh, it was supposed to be our, our happy weight loss show, where everyone gets along, and everyone's motivated, and everyone's happy, but that's not the case. Tammy was tripping. Tammy is mad. I mean, Amy's pregnant, she got her, she's got her baby, she's happy, she's lost the weight, but you know, even she's starting to, you know... You know slip a little bit and oh, everyone's yeah. everyone's just man tears you know fingers are being pointed Ooh. drama the drama <laughs> so today they're going to therapy you know they, they gotta talk about this they gotta talk the problems out they gotta they gotta get to the bottom of it but before we get to that look at the graph please subscribe if you're not subscribed already leave a like leave a comment do all that cool stuff because the more of that stuff that you do the more people will see the video and then we can all enjoy it together we'll the, the channel keep growing and couch king will be huge and we'll get five million in no time it'll be fantastic of course, you can check out Buff Pro and Buff Pro on YouTube and Twitch. Let's get to it. Let's do it. No more big ramps. Michael wouldn't have been able to do it. <laughs> Who? Wait, is that? Wait, Michael, is that Amy's? That's Amy's husband, right? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He's talking that junk, you know? Hey, like, yeah, Michael wouldn't have been able to do that. You see these guns, girl? Yeah, yeah right. throw a little shade out there. <laughs> That's why they're going to therapy. Comments yeah. like that. <laughs> Comments like that. Everybody's had the COVID test. Yeah. Everybody's good. You guys okay if we take these off? Yes, ma'am, oh, please. Oh, thank goodness. Tell me twice. <laughs> oh, heck yeah. Oh, sure, get that out of my face. Time. I'm just thinking about it like from a production standpoint to where like they probably asked her to say that. It's like, okay, but well, before everybody just sits without their mask on, everyone complains, you know, but everybody's, you know, good. You've had your tests. Okay, now let's take them off and like wink at the camera. Like, chill out, everybody, you know. We were grow up thinking we should hold our feelings in. Oh, so therapist... Sounds like we have to talk about feelings. I don't really know enough about it to be like, okay, well, what is, what is holding your feelings? You know, they say it's bad, but what what is bad about it? Like, I guess it's because of stuff builds up and then it explodes one day, or does it make you like just weird? Oof, what does it do? I don't know. Tough one. I don't know. I think like uh, if you if you because if you have these emotions and these feelings and you don't know how to properly express or feel them or acknowledge them right like mm -hmm. then you can all of a sudden your brain's gonna be like all right here we go we need these you have these weird coping mechanisms that you don't realize that you have so you it, you do some things that you don't necessarily have to be doing and right it's interesting to me like the power of like the social aspect of things like say uh, their situation right here or just like me sitting here and i'm upset about something things don't actually change that are around you like your life but the way you think about it changes it does that make sense yeah so like you're like oh you know you're in your head you're like i'm in a terrible situation oh this sucks but then you could be in that exact same situation be like oh man this is great and you see the positive sides of it and i guess that's what i'm yeah. uh, does that make any sense what i'm trying to say it's like yeah your perception the way you think about it affects like what you, th you think is happening it. yeah it's just your feelings are changing that's important but like the actual physical things around you don't change yeah they're the same yeah well, yeah it's cool man yeah. it's weird dude it's like you know them emotions are gonna come out no matter what yeah it's just how you respond that's true that's true well then you got therapists because you don't know how to deal with it so they you tell them how you feel and they tell you how they think you should feel I lost 118 pounds yeah i just i found out i was pregnant too oh so. wow well congratulations yeah. oh my gosh everything's going well it's like what what why are you getting all this yeah. what, what? this is that Amy face <laughs> no, i like, gained 25 pounds yeah. Yeah. amy's over there like you know celebrating what she's done like all these positive things that cuts to tammy like right when she's giving her like the salty look okay, I still want to okay. kind of re doing all of it okay so what kinds of stuff are you eating dun 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 what is <laughs> oh man uh, oh right now Someone i think we've got to the bottom of the problem <laughs> <laughs> so yeah you want your surgery yeah what are you eating everything okay i look for her to go get my food you know something specific and she brings back something different i'm like is it what i asked for you act like you're the innocent angel oh, yeah. over there. Go there, Ma. Oh, man. <laughs> Ooh, right. I mean, I, I'm, I'm liking their therapist they got here. Yeah, I think she's pretty good. She's going to dig in there. Get him. Bust him yo, out. I, she's needed, yo. She's needed. Yeah, I know. I don't make the greatest just decisions on food, but 
neither do you and you think it's okay just because you had the surgery she had to lose a certain amount of weight before she could have the surgery she didn't lose the weight because of the surgery yeah, there's this whole first step she took that that tammy's just not taking right? yeah exactly and blaming amy for it like yeah. you know it's amy's fault i eat that bad food your fingers sometimes you say this is my money if you don't do it i'm gonna call the cops on you you will lie no i'm not you can ask michael mm. Mm, don't you, don't you, ooh, yeah, ooh, ooh. Somebody get the cops called on him? It my Maybe money. it's Michael. That's why he ain't there. Is <laughs> Michael locked up? Hashtag free my man, Michael. Oh man, the only thing I wish they would change here is I wish they would hire someone to clean that window because God dang, it's nasty. Oh my God. What is happening? Man, to this that's thing? how you know that therapist is good. They got all the snot and tears all over that window, man. <laughs> Everybody in there crying, baby. I'm gonna walk the out, Amy. I'm not doing this. <sighs> the therapist just staring at him. I want to hear what she had to say. Come on now. Well, therapy seemed to go really well. Uh, yeah. Hopefully it went better than that, but we don't have the clips for all that, so who knows? But the next clip we do have is Chris joins Tammy's weight loss surgery. Chris, the guy that's been showing up and talking a lot here lately, he wants to be on the show too, so After here we go. going through what we went through at Dr. Proctor's yesterday with Tammy, she was pretty depressed. So I figured I'd talk to her and maybe just get her in a better mood than what she was when she went to bed. Is he the new gopher? Is Amy fired? I've just seen him wheelchair her around and do everything for her so far i don't hmm. i'm not saying that you know you need to make her walk down there because it's pretty probably far away and she can't but i mean i don't i don't i'll just worry i haven't watched the whole show so i don't know that she's gonna start just like getting him to do everything since amy won't do everything for her right because uh, amy wants what's best for her yeah hey yo put some effort in here match us all right meet us in the middle it's here gonna be an egg white omelet and some yogurt i want to have the same thing too because it ain't gonna hurt me to be a little healthier either. <laughs> okay, all right. My man. Yeah, all right, so, uh, well, I appreciate the effort, but I don't, they've been through this before to where Tammy has someone doing it with her. Her name is Amy. And, uh... <laughs> the project come down pretty hard on me. A little depressed, but I knew going into it wasn't gonna be good. I really don't want to hear her say like, oh, you know, he came down pretty hard to me. I'm depressed. So now that's the reason why I'm not going to get on it. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Got to cut back on them excuses and just make it happen. Don't don't turn it into another reason not to do it. Please. You, you got this. I know it's hard. Come Trust on, me. Timmy. That's a sorry. Dang it. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> All right, Timmy, you're on your own again. Hey, well... <laughs> I ain't in that. <laughs> I tried, Tammy. I tried. Uh, <laughs> I'll be back heading to Chick Fil A. <laughs> Probably why it's healthy because nobody can eat it. I'm done with you. I can't do it. The Greek yogurt needs to be in the garbage can. It does not need to be on the table. <laughs> I don't like yogurt either. So. Oh man, I smashed it, dude. Out. Yeah, you like it? Yeah, give me a little granola in there. You know what I'm saying? Done. One of them is it Greek yogurt? One of them tastes a little bit like sour cream. Is that Greek yogurt? It's Greek yogurt. Okay, actually, Greek yogurt's all right. I like putting like things I would put sour cream on. Like I put a little Greek yogurt on there instead. Now that we're yeah. eating healthier. Yeah, 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 yeah. So, yeah. What, what's the other yogurt? Um, maybe it's just like the flavored Greek yogurt. There's there's some version of yogurt that I don't like, and it's always like the fruity flavored ones. So I don't know if gotcha. that. I guess it's just Greek yogurt because I guess regular yogurt is something else. And I think uh, those have like. Yeah, it's like so much sugar and calories are whack in there, and I don't know. I think it's it's like it's sour already. Like, it's got that little sour taste, but then it's also tart because of the fruit. And I just don't, I don't like that. It's just like, Ugh. put it in your mouth, and then after you've swallowed it, you go, oh, that's 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 my feelings. Don't like it. Sometimes <laughs> Amy will come in with, you know, food bags and say, hey, girl, you got to try this. And I'm like, dude, aren't we on a diet? And she's like, yeah, but it's good. Oh, man. Yeah, well, the thing that I'm I'm thinking about is uh, the physical proof. Like, Tammy gained, like, 50 pounds in, like, a day or something. That ain't because Amy came in and was like, you got to try this. It's good. You know? Right. All she had to do was go to D.A.R.E. Pay attention when D.A.R.E. came to your school. You know what I mean? Just, Just say, say no. no. <laughs> well, I mean, even even though the tempt it's like, you know, of course, it's like an addiction, right? Like, where she's at right now with food. Uh, like, you got to try this. Of course she's going to try it. But at the same time, even if she's trying it, if you have them both sitting together, the amount that Amy's going back up is less than the amount that Tammy is going up or is at. Like the calories needed for Tammy exactly. to remain like this is much higher. It doesn't yes. matter. That's all I'm saying. Like the blame right. is it's, it's How about uh, 
I join you on the weight loss journey for support. And Lord knows <laughs> the old belly ain't going to hurt to go away too much more anyway. Now she really lit up. She's like, oh, yeah, you can do it with oh, me. Woohoo. Another friend. I can blame you too, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> I hope not, man. I hope not. <laughs> I really hope not. Dang. It probably makes her feel a lot better to have, like, you know, that, that someone that's going to do it with her support. Even though Amy is still doing it with her, it's just she's right. further along, and I think there's, like, this resentment built up. But um, as yeah. it, good as it sounds, like, oh, you're going to do it with me, that doesn't mean he's going to do it for you. That's right? true. It's still going to come to the moment to where she still has to make her own decisions and, and do this thing. And it's still going to suck just as bad as whether or not he's trying to help or not. But maybe, yeah. you know, maybe just a little enforcement. Like maybe he'll uh, it'll be tougher on her and she can yell at him. And he'll be like, I don't care. <laughs> Stop <laughs> eat the salad. Or don't eat it, actually. Just don't eat it. Get on board with the diet also. I think that's going to be a good idea. We can motivate each other. It's about the end time we all get on track and get our lives back in order. Yeah, it's about- you said it. You it is about time. All right. Kudos to Chris. Kudos to Chris. Maybe he's that inspiration she needs. Yeah, I mean, it's like Chris is the nice person the entire show. And it's pretty much the comments are always the same thing. It's like, oh, yeah, Chris is so nice. And then Tammy's toxic. You know, you know, you know. Well, I mean, <laughs> she's also struggling. She's she's resisting. She doesn't want to be on the diet. I imagine. She's unhappy. Like, you know, how, do, I get to, do I get to make this choice myself? Or is it like feel forced because it's like hey you're gonna you, you know the consequences here you might you might not be around too much longer if you don't, yeah. if you don't change so maybe she, oh, yeah. maybe it feels forced on her i mean everybody not everybody but i feel most people want to be healthier and look good and all that stuff you know they lose weight uh it's just doing it sucks it's, <laughs> it sucks man it's no fun yeah. it blows well. and then on top of that even like the people that are uh like ripped out of their whole brain they still don't feel like they're the best they could be either. Right. Like it's like never ending. Like so it's not self improvement or just you, you look at yourself and go, ah, you know, I lost all that weight, but man, I got like this, this skin going on here. I don't like that. You know, I want to get, I want to change that. I want to get some muscle. It's like, it's never ending. Right. Right. So I guess what I'm trying to say is like when you're in this situation, they're in like, it's like a, you got your goal in mind. You gotta have goals, right? Yeah. The goal is very, straight to they want to lose this amount of weight making it just that goal because once you get to the goal then like what happens after that goal right it's lifestyle changes gotta right. happen you don't have to go on a diet you just have to change your eating habits your diet will get you to where you want to be but you're also gonna have to make just life changing decisions <laughs> about like your uh, your your habits and what you eat to like make long-term changes i guess what i'm trying to say anyway let's keep going <laughs> no you're right <laughs> feeling rambly today man no man no you're you're on it though let's keep going this one's called tammy receives an alarming phone call from amy an alarming phone call what is this in their yard i've been sitting here looking at this is that used to be what? a satellite <laughs> yo somebody stole the direct tv <laughs> <laughs> dang somebody stole that dish uh, that's the, left the railroad, railroad tie there instead those things are heavy by the way uh the cross tie yeah yeah God. Right. It's the last time I got stung by a wasp. I was kicking on a cross tie, and it crawled out of that sucker and stung me. <laughs> I went to go to the hospital, but who would push me to a room? Because it's a long distance walk. Is Amy having a baby? Is it baby time already? Is it baby time? Dang! All right, and now we're seeing like the, oh, like she can't make the walk to go and support her sister. Oh. Go in oh, and push me to the room and then leave. Not nice to do, but white. Man, wait, wait a minute. Got cigarette ashes on the ground by her foot. Oh, gosh. Is the smoking oh, no. chair? Yeah, that might be the smoking chair. <laughs> Shoot, okay. She just spins around and watches her phone and smokes <laughs> with that surround sound speaker behind her. I see. <laughs> yeah, this is, the, this is the chill spot. <laughs> Say what he says. Bye. Bye. <laughs> That's a conversation. <laughs> All right. Uh, bye. Bye. <laughs> bye. Two hours later. No, you're not on live support. What? <laughs> what? You're I'm not too young. gone. What? A t- what? I'm too young to die. What is happening? She says she's on life support. Amy. 
Man, this cameraman's breathing hard. Oh, Dang. I know, man. He's, he's drunk all, all over the place. What is this? Man, he's as flustered as she is. What does she take? Because now she's like talking out her head, crying, thinking I'm in the hospital. She don't want to be on life support. Something's going on. What the heck is happening? What? What happened? She's delusional. She she high. She's high. She's in the cloud right now. <laughs> they hit her with something. And she's yeah. She's having, a, she's having a bad trip, bro. Amy just called me from the hospital and she's crying and upset and just like her mind don't sound the same. I know this is a serious situation, but we know she survives. I'm just <laughs> <laughs> maybe she's like Professor X. Oh yeah, get, get my head, Charles. <laughs> yeah, Charles got my head. <laughs> <laughs> The comment here says, poor Amy, she's always, she always gets like this in the hospitals. So I guess every time she goes to the hospital, she freaks out about it. Uh, yeah, okay, okay. And then the pregnancy hormones. You gotta I guess so. Even harder. Yeah, I hate, the, I hate this clip because it just gives us nothing. Like even the, ne the next one, the next one is just like, it says, Amy reveals her baby gender. That's it. Like, it doesn't even oh, talk about it anymore. Oh my God. <laughs> what a clip oh. here. Well, anyway. We know she survives. Everything's fine. You know, who okay. knows what actually happened? I don't know. Maybe you guys, if you guys watch the show, you can tell us in the comments. But uh, that's it for this video. Today's your birthday, birthday. Say toast, my friends. I love you.